don't let the name fool you. A black hole is anything but empty space. Rather, it's a great amount of space packed into a very small area. Think of a star 10 times more massive than the sun squeezed into a sphere approximately the diameter of New York City. The result is a gravitational field so strong that nothing, not even light, can escape. In recent years, NASA instruments have painted a new picture of these strange objects that are, too many, the most fascinating objects in space. Scientists can't directly observe black holes with telescopes that detect X-rays, lights, or other forms of electromagnetic radiation. We can, however, infer the pressure of black holes and study them by detecting their effects on other matter nearby. If a black hole passes through a cloud of interstellar matter, for example, it will draw matter inward in a process known as accretion. A similar process can occur if a normal star passes close to a black hole. In this case, the black hole can tear the star apart as it pulls towards itself. As the attracted matter accelerates and heats up, it emits X-rays that radiate into space. Recent discoveries offer some tantalizing evidence that black holes have a dramatic influence on the neighborhoods around them, emitting powerful gamma ray bursts devouring nearby stars and spurring the growth of new stars in some areas while stalling it in others. A study on dozens of galaxies within several billion light years of our own has revealed black holes that far exceed our expectations on just how big these monsters can grow. Physicist Julie LaRondo from the University de Montreal in Canada said the following, Galaxies are the building blocks of our universe, and to understand their formation and evolution we must first understand these black holes. One is to find a relationship between a black hole mass and the galaxy surrounding it. If there was an easy way to match a galaxy's size with the black hole at its core, it would save a lot of hassle. To estimate the size of the black holes themselves, we analyze the spectrum of X-rays being spat out by the whirling disk of heated gas being sucked in by the crazy gravity wells. We then correlated this figure with the overall luminosity of the surrounding galaxy. It makes sense that the bigger the galaxy, the bigger the black hole, but this relationship isn't quite as simple as we thought. We have discovered black holes that are far larger and way more massive than we thought. Rather than growing in tandem, the masses of a number of the black holes far outstripped expectations, growing faster than other stars in the neighborhood. In fact, around 40% of them weighed the equivalent of 10 billion times the mass of our sun. They don't come much bigger. The current record holder comes in at around 17 billion suns though other studies hint at a 40 billion solar mass giant 12.1 billion light years away. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.